What's up, you guys? It's me, Keith, with KL Imports, and today we're gonna be working on this 1999 Toyota 4Runner. The problem we have in is the gas gauge. What's going on is the gas needle is always stuck at half. And when we fill it up, it go to full. And then when it get empty, it go back down to half. And a lot of people are like saying it's the sending unit, but before you change out the sending unit, I want you to try something else because I'm dropping the tank and change out the sending unit. It's a lot of work and um, try this out first. And if this don't work, then after that, you can change out the sending unit. And uh, for this model, it, st it started from 1996 to 2002. So pretty much all the years of those are the same and you can do the same thing. So I'm gonna show you how to test it first before you try to change out your ascending unit. Turn it one click. See how my gas gauge right here, the needle is at half. So even though it's empty, it's always gonna be stuck there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to check it the first way before you drop the tank and change out the sending unit. Let's go check it out. Okay, I'll show you where to check it out at. So what I'm gonna do is it's gonna be in the back seat. It's gonna be under this seat right here. So what we gotta do is uh, lift the seat up. How you gonna do that is this, this. Just yank it up. Same thing with this other side. What we have here is this cover and underneath this cover is the fuse sending unit and it's very hard to get to and the only way to get to it is um you have to drop the tank but what i'm going to show you the quick way to test it first is um this wire right here it's a ground wire to the pump and the gauge this ground wire the color to it is brown and black so it's brown with a black stripe. I don't know if you can see it real good here. There we go, yeah, brown black stripe. So we're gonna tap into this and then we're gonna give it a good ground. And that's um, a way to test, to see if you got good ground for your gauge and your fuel pump sending unit. And now I'm gonna tap the wire into it and then tap it to ground and see if our gas needle is gonna go down. to the ignition. Thank you. 
like all this ground. There. That should come right back up. So you see, it's not our thinning unit. It's just the background. So once we ground this, everything is easy. You didn't have to change your fuse sitting unit. All the hard time dropping the tank and everything. Thank you for watching. Like I said, that's the quickest way to um, check on your gas needle to see if it's working. Besides, you know, changing out the sending unit and dropping the tank because that's a lot of work. Now, if that doesn't work, then yes, you will have to drop the tank and change out the sending unit. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment, click the like button, and don't forget to subscribe.